guys, Sean C. Phillips here with a brand new unboxing video. And this time I'm going to be unboxing the brand new uh, 4K collection here. This is the Resident Evil 4K limited edition collection here, which includes all the films on 4K, as well as Blu-ray copies and then digital copies as well of the films. It's in a very, very cool hardbound box here. I'm going to show you guys a closer look inside, and you know, a, you know, a detailed look inside at all the contents that are in here. Look at the disc, talk about the special features, all that kind of stuff as well here in this video. And thanks so much to Sony for sending over a copy of this set to show you guys. Now, if you guys have never seen the Resident Evil films, you know, they're based on the video game series. And the video game series are exactly a series of games that I remember playing, you know, when they were brand new on PlayStation. I remember absolutely loving those games. I especially played uh, part two and three. And I remember, like, playing those games and getting, like, super freaked out. I remember as in middle school when they came out. I think it was, like, in the sixth grade or something like that. And I remember, like, absolutely loving those games, but getting, like, really obsessed with them. And then also very, very freaked out. But it was one of those things where it was like once you started those games, you had to like do anything you could to beat them. So you were always like playing them like constantly like crazy. I haven't played any of the new games in years, but back in the day, I absolutely loved them. So when the, you know, that I heard they were making them into movies, I was so excited about them. And I've always loved these movies. And I feel like these are films too, where the series of like every single one of them to me was just as good. Like I thought like every, you know, I, I kind of thought too, as they went along too. They got even bigger with what was happening the story-wise, and what just kind of got more and more uh, interesting what was happening. I don't know. Honestly, though, I've liked every single one of the films, you know, in the series and everything. Of course, they star uh, Mila Jolovich, and it's uh, basically though about her character waking up in this mansion, and you know, she doesn't exactly know what had happened. She her memory is kind of totally missing and she gets taken in by these people goes underground into the umbrella you know corporation building of course it's you know flooded with zombies and it's basically these films go through with her character following her character and some of the other survivors throughout the years and it's basically you know um all sorts of things are going on with cloning and you don't know who you can trust and all these different things and cover-ups and everything with this, you know, what it had come out with, you know, what turned everyone into zombies and everything. But a really, really cool series of films. Absolutely love these ones. Like I said, it includes all of the films here on 4K for the very first time. This very cool set here. And I'll let you guys know some of the stuff that's in here. Uh, you know, on the Resident Evil, on the Blu-ray, it has a cast and filmmakers commentary, a visual effects commentary, alternate ending with director Paul W.S. Anderson video introduction, uh, 14 featurettes, a music video on there by Slipknot. The 4K version uh, includes a theatrical trailer on the um, Resident Evil Apocalypse that has on the Blu-ray filmmaker commentary, cast commentary, writer commentary, deleted scenes, uh, you know, uh, game over Resident Evil reanimated documentary, uh, some more featurettes on there. It has on the um, 4K, it includes the theatrical and extended cuts of the film, as well as the uh, theatrical trailers. On Resident Evil Extinction, it has on the Blu-ray, uh, picture in picture featurette, filmmaker commentary, deleted scenes, four featurettes. On the 4K edition, it includes the Resident Evil Roadmap, uh, reflections on the future of the series, as well as theatrical trailers. On Afterlife, on the Blu-ray, it includes Undead Vision, picture in picture, filmmaker commentary, deleted and extended scenes, outtakes, feature, uh, seven featurettes. On uh, the 4K, it has Project Alice activated in theatrical trailers. On Resident Evil Retribution, on the Blu-ray, it has a director's and cast commentary, filmmaker commentary, deleted extended scenes, outtakes, uh, interactive um, database, Project Alice, uh, eight featurettes. And on the 4K, it has uh, Evil Goes Global, Undead Retribution, theatrical trailers. And then finally, on the final chapter, that has on there, on the Blu-ray, Retribution mood, Paul, uh, Mode, Paul Thomas Anderson, Amila uh, Jovic, Breakdown, Key Moments and Discuss the Franchise, three featurettes. And on the 4K, it has uh, Maximum Carnage, Best Kills, Creature Choreog uh, Chron Chronology, as well as uh, theatrical trailers on uh, these ones. So lots and lots of features on here. And I'm going to show you guys, though, a look inside the set and how this opens and everything. You can take this card right off here. Here's a look there at the front, at the back here, around to the back. And then here, look on the, on the bottom. And the top, it has Resident Evil up here. And it opens up just like this. So it opens up like this. And then in here, you see all the discs like this. But I'm going to show you guys, though, a close-up look, though, showing you all these uh, discs now, though. So now we're going to take a closer look inside here at the box set, look at the discs and all that kind of stuff here. And I want to make sure to mention as well, though, uh, 4K-wise picture quality and all these ones, these all look great. Uh, if you guys have 4K capacities, would definitely recommend upgrading these ones. These films all have, like, really cool, like, the way that they're lit and everything. Very super atmospheric movies, so translate really, really well on 4K. So definitely would be worth upgrading to for the 4K versions of these ones.
Legends. But here's a look though at the first film here. Uh, and this is the one, I remember seeing this one in theaters so well. Like I, I, I absolutely was, like I said, was so excited to see this one. Uh, and, and each one of these ones has, you know, like I was saying, the 4K and the Blu-ray disc. Uh, here's a look though at Resident Evil Apocalypse. This one was all set like in the city. I, I always liked this one a lot. And here's a look though inside. And here's a look though in the back for Resident Evil Apocalypse. And this one here always kind of reminded me a little bit of kind of like a Mad Max kind of feel. Because was I believe, was this the one out in the desert? I, be, I believe I believe this was the one out in the um, the desert, unless I'm mixing it up. But I, and I might, might be mixing up the order of these ones. Let me look on the card here to make sure I don't mix up the orders. I think that, I think they're in the right order. I believe this, I'm pretty sure this was the one that was out in the desert, which I always remember really liking uh, that one. Yeah, because it had like a Mad Max kind of feel to it a little bit. Here's a look though at the back here. And then here's a look though at Resident Evil Afterlife. Here's a look inside here. But all, like I was saying, all very, very fun films. And then here's a look at Resident Evil Retribution here. Here's a look though at the back. And then here's a look though at the last one, Resident Evil Final Chapter. So I really like this one a lot. Ruby Rose was in this one here as well. Here's a look though inside. And then it also has in here too, a booklet which has stuff about the films, you know, about the features, the cast, all that kind of stuff on here, you know, the features that are on these ones and all that kind of stuff. So a very, very cool set here. So anyway, though, guys, that was my unboxing and review here of the 4K collection here of the Resident Evil films. Really, really cool films. Absolutely love these movies. So really cool to have these ones here in a 4K collection here of all the films together. But anyway, though, guys, like I always say, if you guys enjoyed these unboxing videos, uh, definitely give this video a thumbs up. Thanks again for watching and subscribing, and I'll see you guys later.